The coronavirus is an unprecedented global threat, including for Africa. But if governments and communities act swiftly, we can save lives, protect healthcare workers, and reduce economic harm. Normally, most countries have enough doctors, nurses, and hospital beds. When a new disease like the coronavirus emerges, for which we have no immunity and no treatment, a single case can grow into tens of thousands, overwhelming health systems. The rapid growth of the pandemic is scary, but it is people who spread the virus and people who can stop it. Common sense practices like washing your hands with soap and water, covering your cough, and staying home when sick are a good start. Communities also need to set limits on physical contact. That's because coronavirus depends on social activity to spread. Like turning off a tap, these restrictions reduce social activity from a steady stream to a trickle. This is already happening around the world. Sports fans are sitting this season out. Worshippers are practicing their faith without gathering in churches and mosques. Businesses are temporarily closing, shoppers are limiting their visits to the market, and children are studying from home. When combined, these changes can flatten the curve, limiting the surge in patients so hospitals can improve care. These interventions are disruptive, but the sooner we adopt them and the more firmly we stick to them, the quicker we'll limit the virus. Your actions could save a parent grandparent, a friend, or a neighbor. Then, when the pandemic slows down, governments can gradually lift the most severe restrictions so that some activity can resume and the economy can grow. If the disease returns, we will have to again tighten the tap on daily activities. Until we have a vaccine or treatment, coronavirus is here to stay and abruptly lifting all countermeasures would cause cases to spike. We don't know how long this will take, but as populations build immunity, scientists develop treatments, and governments strengthen their health systems, we should see fewer cases. This will require a careful balance, loosening and tightening the tap over time. <laughs>